here to support Tony Avella's proposed ban and in support of the mayor. Here's my concern. There's been no lack of information provided to you as a council. You're well aware of the issues and have ample time. My concern is that the statements that were made earlier that there's been just a few accidents relative to other traffic accidents. It's not much. We're doing well. Um, and one stable might look better than the other, quote unquote stable. That the response by the council will be, let's just have a few improvements. We can say we've done a good job. We can pat ourselves on the back. And let's be done with this aggravating issue. Note to the side, uh, Gennaro's uh, treatment of us today, horrifying. Okay, so you get him to agree to make a few improvements. How can a few improvements actually help the situation? If these people on the industry side thought that there were issues, in their bill they would have outlined remedies to get rid of us. They would have said, let's just resolve some of the things that concern these human acts, these crazy people, despite the fact that we're business owners and well-educated, and they would have addressed that. Instead, what do they address? They address the victimized please, bring in their children, save us, we need to have one full job for the rest of our lives, instead of taking control, retooling like the rest of us, and taking accountability. What does their uh, bill talk about? Less important than what it doesn't talk about. Doesn't talk about adding humidity factor. Doesn't talk about windshield. Doesn't talk about providing turnout like the police station. Doesn't talk about ensuring 12 by 12 stalls. Doesn't talk about field inspections by a third party, not by their own people in the stable, but according to the comptroller, according to the ASPCA in the field. Furthermore, if there is an arbitrary limit on not more than one vet visit a year. How does that promote health and safety? It's arbitrary and promoting secrecy and the lack of transparency. Thank you. Thank you, Pam. We can build more jobs or something new and exciting.